Hey everybody, I'm Russ Robo and welcome back to Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. Last time we left off, basically, all I did was uh, finish the paperwork uh, to make my character. Uh, we finished all that business with the, um, uh, with the, what do you call it? Um, it was like a questionnaire, basically. Um, I spoke to the guy, uh, let's see... Caiazus, or what his name was, he gave me directions and a package to deliver to someone else in a, in the city of, where was it, Sidonin, I think. I have the package right here. Directions to Caius Cosidus and package for Caius Cosidus. I'm not sure how to read it, though. Directions. Uh, miscellaneous. Like, how do I... Maybe I can't even read it. I've tried right-clicking on it. Um... And then there's, what was it to, okay, that's jump. Hey, it's my hands. Okay, you have to do your hands and then, what was cast again? Oh, there it goes. I also got this, an ancestral ghost. Like once I got outside, they gave me access to all of my spells and magicka, so I started messing around. Actually summon. Let's probably put the hands away so that no one perceives me as a threat. What? Oh, I need to turn up the volumes. One second. I'm just going to do that real quick. Uh, let's see. Are you the one that the boat... Are you the one that boat dropped off? Odd to see a boat arrive at that time of day. Hope the Imperials treated you okay. I swear they took my ring. I swear, one of the guards had it. I had it last week before their weekly Let's Shake Down Fargoth ritual. An engraved healing ring. Family heirloom of mine. You haven't seen it, have you? Your journal has been updated. Uh, no, sorry, no ring. Yes, I have it. Ah, oh, blasted. Yeah, I do have the ring. <sighs> I'll give it back. I'll be a good guy. You found it! Amazing! Thank you, thank you. You are now my favorite friend. I'll be sure to tell the others, especially my friend RL, who runs the tra trade house here. Go see him. He'll be happy to see you now. Ah, uh, hey, you know what? It wasn't completely all for nothing. I got some good deals, maybe. Journal has been updated. Engraved Ring of Healing has been removed from your inventory. Now, of course, I can ask him about background, latest rumors, a little advice, but... Oh, man, my trade, ring, services, someone in particular. So much stuff I can ask him about. Let's ask him about the background of the place. Let's see. I am Fargoth, commoner. Really? That's, that's it? Okay, great. <laughs> I'll figure out more to ask later. I don't want to spend the whole time reading. Which is funny, because this game is supposedly slam full of books. Jumpy! Jumpy! I have no idea really where to go. I think this is the guardhouse. It's like a guard tower. It looks cool. I kind of want to go to the center of town. Oh, I miss jump being, um, what was it? Spacebar. Luminous Rosalia. Can I collect that? Wait. Luminous Rosalia. Water breathing. Huh. Take it. I should have just probably taken all. Get those ones o over there, but I figure it's best to start heading towards town. My character runs really slow. Is this actually running or not? Jumping. No, I don't wanna I don't wanna wait. So we've got the main town we popped up to. We spoke to him. If it's anything like Oblivion, Wooden Door to to Sidanin, Vondus Nasius House. It's going to be a little bit difficult pronouncing the names, but eh, it'll be alright. 
Where's the music button? I need to turn that down. Escape. No. Options. Music. Way much lower. Excellent. Not that I don't like the music. Once I love the, the music, bomb. but... What? What'd you just call me? Yes. What do you want? If you're looking to get out of Cedanine, I'd be happy to give you a little advice. That's what I need. New here? Take the Silt Strider to Vivek or Balmora. Fast and cheap. No trouble with wild animals and smugglers and bandits and outlaws. You you trying to scare me, bro? Go see Darvain Hilleron over at the Strider port. Over the bridge and cast along the water. And tell her Vodimus Nisus sent you. Alright, sorry about that. Oh, I finished his dialogue. I kind of want to ask about this little secret thing. Daedra? You know what they are, right? Well, Daedric Shrines are where Daedric cults worship Daedra. Bad people who summon bad Daedra. Stay away from them. Why? Because Daedra are nasty, and the folks that worship them are even nastier. Oh, well, he's prejudiced. <laughs> Goodbye. Daedra aren't so bad. Until one of them kills me, then they're totally bad. For me. But not for you. Wooden door, Cedanine, Terius, Gravanius' house. I'm, I know I'm butchering these names, but... I'm in a hurry. I don't have time to pronounce them all perfectly. Is it Burglar's Bane? Uh, Drain Speed. Uh, well, anything's appreciated right now. Anything I can get for free, that is. Because, I mean, when you first start in an Elder... When you first start out in an Elder Scrolls game, most of what you find is, um, like, not for sale. It's thieving, stealing. It's not yours. I'm waiting. Uh, okay. You're new to Cedanine, right? I'm Telari Helvi. I'm sure you have questions. Go ahead, ask. I have plenty of time. Well, I don't, woman. Let's see, latest rumors... What's been going on in town? I heard there's been some trouble up at Fort Frostmoth. Ever heard of it? It's on an island called Solstein, north of Vardenfell. Oh my gosh. <laughs> if you've actually been able to play, um, Skyrim, that's just awesome hearing those names. It's kind of sad that the first time I experienced Morrowind was through Skyrim, because of the DLC. But, that's not so bad. I mean, technically, the first time I ever got to see it see it was watching one of my friends play it in school. Uh, Violet Corpus. Yes. Wait. Violet Cor... Co... Prinus. Copernus. Huh. Violet Copernicus. Huh. Not bad. My time is precious, so make it quick. Oh, well, since you came up to me, fine. We were so new to see the name. I'm sure you have questions. Go ahead, I ask her plenty of time. Interesting. She's kind of like the same as the other lady. Not much here. Ariel's trade house, the census and exercise and exus offices. That's the coast guard too, and a lighthouse. And that's it. Silt Strider services go to Vivek and Balmora, Nisus and Saran. The road goes north past Pe uh, Pelagod. To Balmora and cast to Vivek. And east to Vivek. Duh. And southeast to Ebenhart. Huh. Okay. I still want to find that trade house. I'm sure it's, uh. Duh, there it is. It's got a. a deer? I almost called it a llama. Huh. Watch this right above it. Go ahead, stranger. See you in Ariel's trade house. Lock level 70. Ba oh, that back door. Right. I want to go in the front door. I'm not with that lock level stuff. Sitting there picking locks while the guards are looking right at me. Uh, yeah, that's the one. Hey, let's talk to you. See what you can sell me. Sell me. I'm waiting. I, I don't care if you are. Oh, probably shouldn't just go where I'm not wanted. Hey, this guy looks cool. Who are you? You're on your honor. Don't press your luck. Uh, don't you whistle at me, sir. I don't know you like that. You look like you could use a friend. Whoa, you hadn't even bought me lunch yet. Outlander, perhaps I can be your friend. I'd like you to help me recover some gold. That's right. See, I had a bad run. A bad. That's right. See, I had a bad ruck of... 
I had a bad run of luck playing nine holes, and lost a bit of money. Normally I'd be fine, but can usually keep some gold in our pockets just from the money the locals pay us for protection. But I know some of them are holding out on me, especially that little fetcher, Fargoth. He's come up light in the past couple of weeks when I've shaken him down. I know he's stashing it somewhere. I'd like you to find Fargoth's hidden place. Fargoth's hiding place. Isn't that the guy I just gave the ring to and he likes me? But now this guy wants me to sort of... Eh, whatever. I'll do whatever. Fargoth's hiding place. I know the little fetcher's got somewhere in town. Got, got one somewhere in town. Just not sure where yet. I've already gone through his whole house, so I know he's not hiding it there. I'd like you to find out where he's stashing his gold if you can. I'll give you a share of the wealth. Are you up for it? Uh, no. I'm not going to betray him. No? Well, I'll find someone else to do it then. Huh. Well, this isn't like a lot of games. When you don't want to do what you don't want to do, they just straight up tell you. I don't need your help. Your Stop honor, whistling at me, dammit! I don't know any of you like that! that. I don't want to know your things. I will listen. Who are you? You just trade a lady? Elon. Go ahead. You're not interrupting anything. I'm Elon Scout. You need directions. Pelagad, Balmora, Caldera, Ebonheart, Vivek. Ah, I'll find my own way. If you we'll take want the soul strider. Now's the time to talk. <laughs> I love it. Now's the time to ask. I cut her off completely. So, raw specific place, someone in particular, or just need a little advice. Whatever it is, I'd be happy to help. Get food and sun sundries from Ariel's Trade House. That's also where you'll find anyone who's offered tra offering training. How much in the way of services in this damn little squad? Huh. You mean the place I'm currently in? Good God, look at that dude's nose. Specific place you're looking for. Not much here. Ariel's Trade House, the census... Ah, I already asked about that. Who's the trader? Probably not trader, but... The, um, uh, the merchant, on, probably man. downstairs, like the first desk on. when you walk in. Yeah, How this couldn't be the merchant you? or anything. Ariel. So, well, it is your trade house. Welcome to Ariel's trade house. I barter for goods for coin. I also small, small, sell, I also have a small selection of spells for sale. No credit? You want a little advice? That's free. That's all that's free. Would you like to hear about our most... Popular potions or our our most popular scrolls? Ah, spells, little advice, popular potions. Let's go with spells. Absorb. Wait, I bet I don't have a lot of money. Nope. Ooh, frostbite. Fireball. Ah, uh, jack of trades. Fortify luck. One hundred points or ten points. That'll be awesome. Uh, I kind of have some good spells already. Speaking of which... Magic. No, 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 that's not it. That's my inventory. I need to see my spells. Uh, let's see. S? No, duh. Uh, magic, It just M. stood there, holding its tail and whispering. What did it say? No, that's wait. That's auto walk apparently. Speak, traveler. No, I don't want to speak. I want to open up my spell in my spell interface. Wait, was it? I think I remember. Nope. That's how I look at myself. Backspace, enter, shift, alt, control, control. Oh, that's how I crouch. Man, <laughs> it's been a long time. I'm trying to get back into the swing of things. Uh. Dang it, stop activating weight. I'll figure it out later. Yes? So, especially since I don't know what I'm doing. Not a problem. What can I do for you? Looking for someone in particular? No. Let's see. Huh. Just running around. I guess I'll cross this bridge and find the Silt Strider? It's gotta be around here somewhere. I saw it in the video that I recorded, like, 
when I went back and looked at it, I was amazed at how I could miss something so freaking huge. I don't want to spoil it for... Oh, who hasn't seen it? It's this giant flea-looking thing. It's huge. And I can't read those signs, but I guess they weren't meant to be read. Did I miss the Silk Strider? I think I missed him. Because that's the main road. I don't want to take the main road. I want to take the Silk Strider. Man, I got need... There he is! Look at that huge thing. How did I miss that? Well, I guess I'll take the main road and just, like, show the Silk Strider just so that people can see him because he's kind of cool. Kind of cool looking. Walk faster. It's the first thing I'm going to upgrade is speed. Nice tree. Sort of come up here and... We make a special trip just for you, same low price. We make a special trip just for you, same low price. Well then, how is it special? I guess because I'm the only one going. And of course it wouldn't be a good idea to try to jump into it because I would fall short and fall on the ground. But you know what? I ain't paying that gold. I'm going my own way. Oh great, it's nightfall. I don't think this game in particular has anything bad about Nightfall, though. Some games, you know, you play them nowadays, it's like, oh, night is falling, prepare to get pooed on. But not this one, probably. I like that howling noise in the background. Kinda reminds me of, uh, the DLC. What is Stop whistling at me! I don't know you like that! <laughs> Jeez. I guess I'll just take, what is this, the main road? I mean, it's the only bridge I see. I'm taking it. Well, since I'm outside of the safety of town now, I'm going to equip my spells. Wait. Oh. Okay, so R, magic. F, melee. I like magic better. I bet that's a mud crab. I'm gonna go kill it. I need to train against something really low level. Okay. Ow. Kill him. Get him, big guy. Yay! It worked. We killed it. What crab? Thought so. What's it got? Crab meat. Restore fatigue. Eh, just for the alchemical of it all. I wonder if we would have defeated it that easily had the guard not showed up. Dang. So, uh, guard, you gonna stick around and, like, you know, guard me all the time? That would be awesome. Huh. What grab? I'm wandering a little bit. I better get back to the main path. How do I run on here? Is this as fast as I can walk? Come on, man. Man, I, I would never walk anywhere. Basic walk speed is this. It's ridiculous. I just run everywhere, constantly. I bet this isn't even run, because it's not taking up my stamina. Now I need to look up run. It doesn't really give you a clear, defined path as to where to go. But I guess that's Morrowind. You know, there's not a lot of trails. I mean, it's rambling a little bit, but man, when you play Oblivion, there is literally a road almost every inch from town to town. There's not... There's wilderness, but there's a clearly defined path if you choose to take it from everywhere to everywhere else. But it's kind of fun, you know, being able to relearn all the controls and relearn everything that you're gonna basically wind up doing for the longest. Because, uh, I've completely, almost entirely forgotten how to do everything. What the hell? Oh yeah, that's right! 
Hey, buddy, you okay? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I knew that was coming, but I didn't want to spoil it for everybody else. Oh, that noise. Tar hell. That is. I don't want to use that yet. Iron Spark Sword. Oh, well. That, that they immediately give me a good blade. That's nice. And gold. All of that. All of the golds. Dispose of the. No, I didn't kill him. He can. His corpse can stay there. Journal of Tarhel. I believe I may have found the correct formula for the spell I am developing. With it, I will be able to travel great distances without the need to pay others for service. If all goes well, I will test out the new spell tomorrow. I believe I have worked out all the possible complications. It will allow me to leap great distances covering many hundreds of miles. Never before has one been able to travel in this manner, vaulting from the ground, sailing through the sky, all without that terrible disorientation of a spell of flying. The time is almost upon me. My research is finished, and all of my calculations are checked and rechecked. They laughed at when I suggested this. We'll see who laughs after I leap to the top of their towers and scream out my success. Well, he did scream. <laughs> oh, that's terrible of me to say that. I guess I'll leave his journal there so that when the end... <laughs> I mean, there ain't nobody coming for him. I'm sorry, bro. You you got pooed on. Hey! Don't I look fabulous? That hat is ridiculous, but I, I kind of like it. Just for the thought of wearing a hat. Yeah! Yeah, I got a sword now. You best watch out, son. What the heck did I just do? So that is run. Well, you better keep on running, son. Stab! Stab! <laughs> yeah, stop doing that. Oh, I get it. When I hold shift and press tab, it opens up the uh, Steam, uh, Steam menu. I guess, uh, hey, there's a path. Just so you know, if you ever want to buy this game, it's available on Steam. See Danine. Oh, you don't need to read the signs. You just point at them. Aldrun, Normok, Hello. I guess Aldrun is the nearest one. Gotta watch my back out here. Stab. Stab. That's an interesting sort of pillar. Reminds me of Oblivion. Run faster. Come on, man, run faster. Acadian Isles region. This is getting creepy real... This is getting real creepy real fast. I don't like this area. That's an enemy. I remember those. Those are scribs, or whatever they call them. No, R. Get ready, you magic. Poof. You failed. Oh, sh... Do I not have enough mana? Oh, my mana doesn't automatically regenerate on here. Uh, what do I do about that? Uh, magic? Scroll of Incarian, Inc Icarian Flight? Don't want to do that. Summon Ancestral Ghost for 60 seconds on self. Uh, what? No, 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 no. You do not have enough magic to cast the spell. Come on, I can do this. Summon Ancestral Ghost, Powers, Dragon... Oh! This is where I selected. Uh, spell, Bless, Touch, Bless, Work, Bound Dagger, Chameleon. There's the cost of the spells and the different spells I can activate. 20 slash 0. What does that mean? Firebite. Water Walking. Magic Items. Cost and Charge. Scroll of Ink. Okay, so that's my magical items. I want... Touch only. Blessed touch. Turn undead. Turn on. Wait. Blessed touch. Turn undead 100 points for 30 seconds on touch. And blessed word. Turn undead 100 points for 30 seconds on target. Okay, those are the ones I got with my uh, sign. Bound dagger. I don't need that. Got a good sword. Chameleon. Detect creature. I already know he's there. Fire damage. 15 points for 30 seconds on touch. Her heal spell. Hearth heal. Restore health. 20 points to 8. Oh, that's what I want. There's only one problem. I just... I don't know how to... I guess I'm bones without mana. Time to use the sword. Maybe I can sneak up on it. Uh. 
Is it drumming the ground? Seriously? What the heck? Die! Oh, okay, I hit it. Yay! I think I missed all the other shots. Scrib. It's got nothing. I told you it was a scrib. That thing freaks me out, man. I'm gonna need to figure out how to regenerate magic. I mean, I made a mana class, and I can't regenerate magicka. That's that's bad news bears right there. What is what is that? I hear word. I hear noises. What noises? This place. Fr Die rat. Jeez, I can't hit things. Come on. Get in the pool of death. Okay, how bad do I suck at physical attack? Alright, let's get onto a level playing field. I have the high ground! You cannot defeat me, Anakin! Okay, you gotta get right up on him. Die already! Ah. Just so you know, I completely forgot that on this game, there is a percentage chance that you will hit or miss based on your skills. I obviously don't have skills. Skills are something I do not have, because I am skillless. I wish I had the mana for this. I'm going to try casting it. It's probably going to tell me I had don't have the mana. Uh, R for magic. And yeah, it's not happening. How do I get mana? Oh, I am in trouble. Can't do mana. In trouble, trouble, trouble. I need to go back to the shop and buy a potion of mana. Or find some way to heal. I'm gonna get killed out here. That was a rat. And I didn't fare too well. Yep. I'm gonna have to go back. Oh! My, my athletic skill increased to six. Hot diggity. Alright. Well, I am going to continue outside of the town and figure out what all I want to do around out there, you know get places and go places and do things but for right now I'm gonna have to figure out number one how to regenerate mana if possible you know something beyond spells or number two figure out some sort of potion that I can use to regenerate mana or figure out what kind of alchemical item I can eat like a mushroom or something to regenerate mana or buy some potions of healing in the town that's another enemy So, I'm going to go on ahead and get back to town and probably call it here. And by the time I come back, I'll probably have some way to better defend myself so that I don't get killed by a rat, which is what almost happened. Alright, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!